Hello everyone, Mark here, Mark's Max Muscle, and we are looking at Akeem Williams. He, of course, is your 2020 Chicago Pro Champion, and this video is not about debating that or saying that he did not deserve the title. Although in second place was Justin Rodriguez, and judging from the pictures and the video footage, he definitely did look outstanding for sure. But of course, in a sport, a sport like bodybuilding, it's so subjective that you can't say for sure that one guy did deserve it. So let's have a comparison between these two, and I use the clearest and the best pictures that I had available. And judging by at least the front relaxed position, Justin Rodriguez definitely in better condition. He has thinner skin, but it is could be a matter of the, the oil. You notice Akeem Williams does not have a whole lot of oil and doesn't glare off his physique, off his muscles, because really when you take a good look at his, his legs, things of that nature, he is in decent condition. It's the ab muscles. I definitely don't think that he has the type of muscle separation that one Justin Rodriguez has. But anyway, guys, we don't have a rear relaxed, so I would go out on a limb, considering how good Justin's back is, and say that Justin would probably get the symmetry round. But the muscularity round could be a different story, and it definitely is a different story in the front double bicep pose. Akeem, as the event went on, he definitely did harden up, and he it looks like he is in better condition here, even in this front double bicep. When you look at the arms, the silhouette, the shape, the proportions, Akeem Williams, he really is crushing Justin Rodriguez. I mean, guys, take a look at the size of his waistline and the legs. He has bigger legs and a smaller waist than Justin. So right out of the chute structurally, he is, he is ahead on points. And the forearms, guys, take a look at the forearms as well. So that is one pose. Go on to the front lat spread. And I would wager to say maybe Justin would get an edge here. He just looks a little bit better. I know he doesn't have the, the small waist of Akeem or even the lags, which kind of cuts into his, his uh, X frame a little bit. Definitely a little undersized in the lags for Justin. You didn't really catch that in the video footage, of course, so maybe better proportions for Akeem. But upper body-wise, the... The width of the clavicle, the chest, all them things taken into consideration. Things of that nature, I guess. And, of course, the, the V-taper of the upper body. Justin might be getting an edge. So, I would give more of an edge to Akeem in the front double by than Justin's getting here. But, I don't know. It's still pretty close after the first two shots. Turn to the side. And Akeem definitely is making a really good case for himself. Look at the lags, guys. Glutes, hamstrings, quads. Some of the best lags in bodybuilding history from the side display, for sure, Akeem Williams. Justin Rodriguez doing a real good job with the upper body. I like his pec, arms, good muscle separation, biceps, triceps, delts as well. But Akeem, he is just a sheer beast. And when you look at his legs, guys, I mean, come on. Really, even in the calf department, he is destroying Justin Rodriguez. So... Not much controversy so far. Go to the side tricep. And this is basically the same story as the side chest development. It seems Akeem, he is a beast. Let's face it, guys. He is a beast in the mandatory poses. What he lacks, mid-sec uh, midsection separation, muscle separation, he more than makes up for. And just sheer size. Look at his tricep. Huge. And food for thought, guys. His midsection looks... Maybe even a little bit more better conditioned here, at least in this pose, against Justin Rodriguez. Not the best pose for Justin. Maybe lacks size in the lags. And that, that seems to be the whole story in this, uh, or a recurring story in this comparison. Justin, he just does not match up to Akeem as far as the lag size is concerned. But there is the all-important back shots, back comparisons. And I would wager to say Justin is definitely getting an edge. He's getting an edge in the conditioning, the back muscles itself. Hakeem is a very long-legged and short-torsoed individual, and that I think that really hurts him in the back poses, at least in the rear lat spread. Of course, judging by this comparison, I don't know if I got the sizes correctly or not. It, is, it seems Hakeem's legs are just overwhelming, and if I made him any bigger to get the backs to scale, I don't know. It, maybe Hakeem leans forward. Creates a lack of size in the back and Justin leaning back. Hard to say, really, though, guys. Anyway, I give an edge to Justin. Go to the rear double bicep. And these are this is from a different album. Uh, 
thrown through some filters there. And you'll notice the background of these guys. And I got no problem with the lighting on this one. That's not the issue. It was the background. You had all these flames and these little discs flying around. That's not what you need behind for a background for bodybuilding. You need something bland that just, you know, you're supposed to ignore it. Anyway, conditioning goes to Justin. Back development, Justin. This is this is definitely an argument, guys. Akeem was winning most of the front and side shots. And Justin winning both of the back poses. Unfortunately, there was no ab and thigh comparison. And neither guy is the best. Was a blurry old pitcher, but you can't really see conditioning. Neither one really dominating, though. So on to the most muscular. In which case, it is a debatable one, guys. This whole competition, a little bit debatable. Structurally, at least in the fronts, front poses and side poses, Hakeem Williams is just dominant. He's a beast. But tight conditioning, thin skin, things of that nature. Justin Rodriguez, here's the crab position to put a final nail into this coffin situation. And Akeem Williams, he is beast-like again in this. He's really filled out nice. Look at the quads, even. Look at the feathering. Just incredible. But Justin Rodriguez, he is just as good, guys. Thin skin, muscular, muscular uh, vascularity, muscle separation, excellent physique. So honestly, guys, it really could have went either way. But we're gonna, we're not gonna take anything away from Akeem Williams. He is your 2020 Chicago Pro Champion, and I have no problem with that. Obviously, I just judged this one, and no real man was dominating. If anything, Akeem may have won on points, if you add up all of the mandatory poses in the muscularity round. Anyway, guys, just figured you would uh, be interested in this comparison. Hit thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Subscribe to the channel. Have a great day.